and shakers and entrepreneurs and business professionals and celebrities and visionaries that are under the age of 30 that are on the trajectory to do really well in their fields. I'm super honored that they would see little old me over here working and accept me and it's so interesting because I have applied for this like for years like and got denied every single time. And so one of my girlfriends was actually coming. I'm so excited. So we're gonna vlog this weekend. And she was like, you should apply again. I was like, but I didn't get it. You know, just discouraged, kind of over it. She was like, apply again. And so I wrote, um, I applied. And you have to write a little summary about who you are and what you are. And some of you guys obviously know I'm a hairstylist and makeup artist by trade. So I do celebrity work, I do editorial, I do print, I do all those great things. Um, but I recently started a nonprofit, and so for the past two years, I've been going into women's shelters and domestic violence facilities and facilitating makeovers for underserved women. And so that's like my little baby and my passion project, and I'm working with women, I'm working with children, and the main thing is just to go in, of course, hair and makeup. When your hair is done, you feel good. When your makeup's done, you feel good. That's just my gift but more so just to go and encourage these women that this is where you are but this isn't where you have to stay and this is where you, isn't where you have to be forever and this isn't the end all be all it's who you are and what you are and so I've been doing that it's been a little old me I try and find facilities that serve maybe like anywhere from like 20 to 100 people I've even put on an event before at a woman's facility for new moms and so they're able to stay at the shelter um, or you know I hate to say the shelter they're able to stay at the facility um, as long as they have a full-time job and they'll help them take care of their children and everything so I bought in a photographer and we gave them mommy baby pictures just something that you know a lot of us will be able to afford or be able to have and look back at these memories before a lot of people they don't have that luxury you know what I mean and while I do all these great things it's just really important for me to pour into the community it's really important for me to pour into just this generation you know what I mean of, of whatever you do to me it's just hair and makeup so it's not a big thing but it can be life-changing for people and um, so I wrote an essay about that and what I do and my girlfriend reached out to me and she was like are we going to Boston which first off I'm a girl when I see her because I feel like what if we weren't going to Boston what if only you were going and it just worked out and I happened to look at my email I had just woke up and I just started screaming I couldn't believe it and you know how strategic is God and the things that he does that I had applied and applied all throughout my 20s never got the opportunity every year it was unfortunately and my 29th year when your girl is about to be the big 3-0 next year I finally got accepted and that's just a lesson in patience that's a lesson in faith that's a lesson especially I don't want to get emotional but like you know social media and comparing yourself and seeing people doing other things and feeling like but what about me what about me and it's like when your time comes nobody can stop it like this year has been phenomenal and I am just so excited because everything that's going on for me right now has been because of the foundation that I've laid throughout my 20s I have worked I have hustled, I have done shoots for no money, $50 was a luxury, I have, my God, you think of it, you name it, I have dealt with a lot, especially living in big cities like New York, especially living in big cities like LA, and I finally am in a space where I'm starting to see the fruits of my labors and the harvest, um, 
of my work and so I just say all of this to say stay encouraged wherever you are no matter where you are what you're doing even if it feels like it's not coming together even if it feels like it'll never get better even if it feels like any of the above just I just want to encourage you guys that like it's not your timing it's God's timing it's the universe's timing it's whatever's timing it's your paying your dues timing you got to go through it to get to it you know what I mean and like it's just such an honor for them to recognize what I'm doing in my community and to invite me and then to even say out of thousands of look I'm gonna be taking you guys on my weekend vlog and yeah so let me put this camera down because my arm is hurting and I've already done like 20 takes So just wanted to check in. It is the first day of the summit for us. The summit kicked off yesterday, but we decided to spend our first day just going around Boston. We went out to eat like twice. We went shopping. We went to the Prudential Center. We literally, our, our view is right across from the Fenway Stadium. So we saw the let out from the Red Sox versus the Yankees. I'm like, of course the Yankees, my team. Well, I'm really a Ravens girl because of Baltimore but um, by default Yankees of course the Yankees will lose the day I get to Boston like the welcoming is that but yeah so just want to do a quick outfit of the day earrings by Zara dress by Zara jacket by Zara this was not by chance shoes I got from DSW they are Jose Vida just have my blue because I needed to take journals and all that kind of stuff and I didn't want to do like a small bag where I'm struggling the other day and so we're just waiting on our Uber and yeah, stay tuned for day one. If so where would people live if they didn't want to live? Uh, here? They go a little outside. Um, the residential area. Okay. And would someone that lives on the outskirts of this area, do the area still look and resemble this or is it more neighborhoody? Uh, a little yeah, similar. Okay. But not like a building tall.
So you click them. You together. click it and you bump and then it like. You, you, you okay. connect the people on okay, LinkedIn or Facebook oh, and so like yeah, and create a contact card. Oh, okay, so huh? you use the app That's and you cool. set up like your little. Yeah. Yeah.